Hey guys, how's it going? Kriparian here. Today I want to give you guys the first time I managed to pull off the Ghoul Exodia build full on. Now, there's a few compromises to the build that you can make. I studied it a little bit as I was pulling it off. So, you know, there's there's ways that you can do the Ghoul Exodia build that's not like full on Exodia and you can still lose and it's counterable and stuff. But this version doesn't have a lot of things that can go wrong. It is one of the best builds in the game, and it is just about the most inconsistent one to build up to. Enjoy. Monster Train is a very well-designed game. It's just like, it's clearly an indie game and didn't, didn't really have massive budget for graphics. All right, fine, I'll, I'll do Arena. Terraria, I watched Quinn play Terraria today. Uh, every single enemy looked like they are from Doom. The original. Every, every single, I kid you not. It's like the flying eyeball thing. It's like the little imp thingies. Everything, everything, everything. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> Seems like an alright game, but I guess you have to play it for a while to really enjoy it. Terraria is from Gears of War. Is that right? And? Oh, nothing. I just shared my first experience watching anyone play Terraria. That was it. Not worth it to freeze for token. Not with Reno. No, not with Reno. Oh, it's okay. We all hit some bumps now and then. You watch Sing Sing for 30 hours the last three days playing Terraria with zero spoilers. Okay. Explain this math. Uh it's simulations. It does like a thousand simulations. It's uh I can't win. If it snipes the one one, it's a tie. But the simulations were not evenly distributed. The chance that simulations are evenly distributed is really low. I'll, I'll repeat that. I'll repeat that because it's, it's a it's a hard thing to wrap your mind around. So I think Ranya said this or talked about this a little bit. So when you when you flip a coin, it's like half the time heads, half the time tails, right? If you flip a hundred coins, the expected result is fifty heads and 50 tails, right? That's the ex that's what you'd expect to get. But it's kind of like a bell curve of variation. The chance that you get exactly 50 heads and exactly 50 tails flipping the coin 100 times, it's actually pretty low. It's the it's the highest likelihood result, but getting exactly that one is actually pretty low. Cuz there's so many things that could happen. Cuz you can get, you can get 100 heads. It's like astronomical, but you could Right, so it's kind of like that. Even though it's a coin flip, because it uses, um, it it doesn't calculate the odds. You cannot calculate the odds. There's too much random bullshit that can happen. It's a lot easier just to simulate it happening. So it simulates it happening like a thousand times, and even if even if it's like a fifty-fifty, it's not always going to end up a fifty-fifty in the simulation. Like, remember when I, I lost the 0% game? I lost the 0% game. It's on Twitter. It happened a few days ago. Um, okay, there's there's some chance the software bugged out and didn't account for something. Yeah. But it's possible that it didn't. If I lost like a 1 in a million and it only did a thousand simulations and it didn't hit it, then it would be a 0% game that I lost. I mean, I, I, I don't know what the case is, but that is an explanation for it. Pretty crazy. I faced Rafam twice and uh, Rat Deathwing in between. Some horrible matchup RNG right now. Your minions really pulled their weight. I don't really like any of those. I guess that's probably the best one now. Oh no! It's it's not that the odds were necessarily sub 0.1 percent. Most likely they were. How should I put it here? If we're talking astronomical level RNG, you could actually have a coin flip game where the add-on that simulates a thousand games, I don't know how many it simulates, but I think it simulates about a thousand. Someone said thousands, but whatever. Let's say a thousand for the sake of argument. Let's say it's a head or tail situation. It's, it's like a 
tie half the time, a loss half the time, right? The add-on, because it gives simulated results, could actually show a 100% loss, even though it's 50% tie. It, it's astronomical, like, like gazillions in one that, that would ever happen, but it's possible. So my point is, God damn it. My point is, um, the game that I lost that was a 0% loss, it could have actually been a 1% chance to lose, and the simulations were really lucky in actually winning, right? Oh boy, this is some rough stuff right here. Well, actually, I'm thinking that selling these and getting a 5 really puts me in about the same position right now. Let's do that. I'm playing on America. How the hell does he have that? So he's playing Murlocs, picked up a Xerus, and got Holy Mackerel. This is this is one of the unluckiest runs I've ever seen. Seriously. That is that is unheard of. I mean unheard of. Let's be real. That is unheard of. It's on 9 gold, so he bought the shifter like last turn. The dude is playing Murlocs, bought a shifter immediately on 3, and it immediately became Holy Mackerel. Dude, and it's got plus 2, plus 2. And he found Murloc buffers on the same round. I mean, I mean, come on. I mean, seriously. Yeah, I played against Rafam twice, who high rolled. I played against Deathwing the instant he found the rat. This, this is a really unlucky run. Could have had an 8-10 Hydra. It's just plus two, plus two, but no, I, I can't really. I'm thinking of, yeah, maybe maybe getting that, but no, I, I need actual death rattles. The Hydra is just the best card out of those to take, so I don't die, because I, I otherwise could die. Images. You're good at this. I really have to go to five to make this really work, but I Dex is so dumb sometimes. He's such a brute. Yeah, instead of like lying down gently. It, like belly flops on the hardwood floor because reasons like the floor shakes so you know how some people go like diving in a pool dex goes diving in concrete yeah very manly alpha dog exactly selfless second uh you typically want to get this cleave going soon i don't think i want to do selfless second no Amazing. Okay. 
Oh wait, I can I can actually try this. I need a triple ghoul, right? And this, right? <laughs> I don't know the I don't know the pieces because it's such a stupid combo. So now I need a triple ghoul and like a rat. That's it, right? Mama, I don't think it's required. You can just buff the rat. Oh my god, it's Milhas again. Has he lost anything? Only Deathwing. Since that, he had 32 health. That's a good snipe attempt. I need two wolves, golden ghoul, rat or wolf. I main selfless. Really okay. Go ahead and hire one of these I probably should have sold that. Do two ghouls work? Or does it have to happen all at once? Like, would Ghoul Ghoul work, or do I need the golden one? Need triple. Fine, let's just use the high main for now. Okay. Hopefully I do it before I die. I mean, yeah, that would be nice, right? Kinda sucks, Goldrum's not dead yet. Take the Hydra. Mostly to get rid of that card. No, Argus is bad. It's really complicated. If I if I get this health over four, it's bad, right? Oh no, because it's triple baron. But I still don't want to give a taunt. Wow, Melhouse died? What the hell? I'm trying to get the ghoul. The ghoul sets everything up. I'm trying to get ghoul and another gold rim. Your minions really pulled their weight. And I'm honestly not used to seeing a ghoul and wanting to pick it, so it's very difficult for me. I have to go slow. I think I'll take a high man again. Oh, that's really good. I probably should double check mechs. I should be fine against mechs. Yeah, I'm trying not to die while I find a ghoul. 
I'm gonna die looking for pieces. I'm literally missing one piece. One. I think with two gold rooms, the combo is sufficient. I think I can do the combo next round. If I'm not dead. Yeah, I should not be dead. Triple's bad. Oh, the selfless doesn't do anything. The selfless is actually really bad right now. Cool. <laughs> well, he's dead. Yeah, a self selfless wouldn't work. Um, the because the ghouls die in sequence, the selfless wouldn't work. Yeah, the bombs are all right. Selfless would not work because the first ghoul kills the selfless. For selfless to work, you need a triple on the ghoul. Selfless would go off in between the ghouls, which is really bad. You do not want that because that can actually screw up the thing from working. Like, if, if the selfless goes off on the high main, the... Actually, would it potentially die? No, it'd still die. No, actually, it wouldn't screw anything up. Hmm. Okay. I'm looking for bombs, ghouls, and selfless. None of which are six, so... Sorry about that, Deathwing, but it's time for you to go. Nice Cobalt Refresh build you had there. <laughs> his Divine Shield Cobalt and his both his taunts had Refresh. And he had Divine Shield times three. And he started with Divine Shield. It was in second position. Didn't attack. There's a selfless. Hiring that minion will get you a triple. 
three divine shields. Three divine shields is worth it. I didn't like that one either. Here's a goal for the trouble. Nothing scares me. Except Do I put selfless here? Yes, we put it there. Cleave might be bad, yeah. I don't know how to position it though. Okay, fine. Guys are playing cobalt builds. <laughs> uh, it's so unfair. <laughs> oh, wow, we killed one. That's pretty good. Yeah, so like, thank you, Smurf account. Thank you. That was the first time I was happy picking Reno. That was the first time I actually landed on a 5-drop with the hero power. And that was the first time I built that thing. And best of all, all the top players were playing mech token builds. Which honestly, there is not a worse build in the entire game to play against this. That is the worst. Is the worst. Like, it's, it, it cannot win. Like, it's... Like you can you can run this you know Doctor Strange fourteen billion times or some shit. It is not going to win. <laughs> it's a heavy RNG build. Keep up the pressure. Look at this, Bob. Bob is like refine your strategy by buying some perks. Really, Bob? After that game, was was that not good enough for you, Bob? <laughs>